spell being cast over the music industry, hip hop, this rap. Simple, y'all. Simple, eh? Hey. What up, world? I've been saying this shit for years. Literally. Literally, man. This shit is serious. It's a fucking evil spell being cast over the black community and hip hop. When the fuck would niggas wake up? This shit so crazy. Everybody so, look, already so into it with each other. We so head to head with each other, folks. We'll never see the real motherfucking wood that's being pulled over the eyes of us, folks. This shit crazy. It's crazy, y'all. But it's serious. It's crazy, but it's serious, and it's real as hell. Don't nobody believe it till they did as hell. And then now they got to tell everybody else in the spiritual world about their spiritual battle, which is dead serious. This shit's serious. Hey, and you know what's funny? It take a bunch of YouTubers to get on YouTube and actually say this shit to make a motherfucker believe it because this ain't the first time I heard it. Now I'm, I'm, I'm listening to somebody else vid. They saying the same shit that I've been saying, and somebody else outside of him going to say the same shit on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? And somebody else on the side of them. It's a whole... Man, it's, it's crazy. Wake up, world. That's all the niggas saying. Wake the fuck up, man. It's more to it than that meets the eye, man. It's more to it than that meets the eye. You know what I'm saying? It's more to life than what our eyes portray us to see. Y'all just got to pay attention to that. That's why that one saying is always thrown out there. Looks can be deceiving. Well, technically what that means is basically the same fucking saying that the Transformers use. More than meets the eye. You know what I'm saying? That's the, that's the fucking slogan. More than meets the eye. And, and the Bible used that a lot. You know, and why is that? Where was that slogan from? Where, where did it come from? Who made that up? Who created that? Well, I'll tell you the truth. The shit is just reality. That's the fucking world we live in. Been living in that world since, man. Ain't nothing new under the sun. And they tell you that. I know a couple of y'all parents out there or grandparents done told you that. Ain't nothing in this world new under the sun. Everything has revolved already. Over and over and over. That's literally. You know what I'm saying? All these sayings, all these uh, quotes and uh, uh, slogans and shit. All this shit is already reverted. It's, it's, it's been here. You know, a lot of the shit have, but our black people knowing that it's a curse on our black community, not only in our communities, the hip hop world, the entertainment world, every, every, every fucking entertainment business or, you know, uh, um, any way to get to the people, you know what I'm saying? To entertain the people by video, y'all already cursed it definitely for our culture. And y'all say, who is y'all? Motherfucker, you figure out the y'alls I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? It's common sense. Go look at a uh, Michael Jackson uh, uh, interview or some shit. Listen to that man, how scared he was when he was telling you, they going to kill me. They And they kept asking, who is they? Yo, it's like, it's deep. You know what I'm saying? And, and people been saying this shit for years. It's a curse. Artists has been saying this for years, going through it, dying behind it. It's a curse, man. It's a fucking curse. Wake up and they tricking the shit out of them because these niggas doing these contracts, signing. Come on, man. Like I said, every every song that I done heard, my nigga ain't once yet told a black male how to get in the music industry. They ain't said, hey, yo, first you got to take your CD down to such and such. Drop it off, hit them up. So none of that bullshit. All these niggas rapping about is that bullshit. The bullshit that's getting niggas killed and knocked off. And now that niggas getting knocked off uncontrollably, you know what I'm saying? Now y'all get knocked off uncontrollably, niggas feel some type of way. You want the shit to slow down, the shit ain't gonna slow down, this shit. This shit going train speed, my nigga. It's like, it's serious, bro. And it's a war going on out here, but it's not a physical war, it's a spiritual war. You know what I'm saying? King Los made a song a minute ago, and, and the video was exclusive, and, and, and that's what it was, you know, in the, in the, in the uh, course, it was saying something like, there's a war going on outside, of your stuff. you know what I'm saying, but he was saying, not a war in the streets, but a war for your soul, literally, and that's what the fuck going on, man, y'all motherfuckers better wake up, dog, why you think they searching for uh, life, or seeing if it's if we able to hold life on other planets, my nigga, it's something bigger going on, my nigga, ain't nobody waking the fuck up. This shit crazy. Everybody still down here living their they lives like this shit. Like y'all don't die. 
like everybody ain't got to die. You know what I'm saying, my nigga? You on a time schedule. You only here to get your shit together and get up out this motherfucker when he take you about this motherfucker. So when you do get your shit together, my nigga, and he take you about this motherfucker, you'll be ready and prepared. You feel me? That's what the fuck you here for. Basic instructions before leaving Earth. Simple. But a lot of you niggas don't take... A lot of you niggas don't take heed to that, bro. I took heed to that a long time ago, as you know. And then he'll preserve you once you do pick up on it. And your mind get open, he'll preserve your ass. And he'll see what you're going to do from there. He's going to carry you a long way, too. He'll carry you a long way. But you got to be... You got to actually hurry up and do that changing. You got to do that changing bit. Because if you don't know my life, your clock ticking, that's it. It's it. Time shuts off. You feel me? I've been paying attention to this shit because, you know, just from motherfuckers around me, man, we see this shit daily. And if y'all really some motherfuckers who pay attention to life, my nigga, and you sort of trying to get this shit down pack and figure out the, the clips and the graphs of this shit, if you sit back and you study certain people and yourself, um, you know, when you reflect and shit and you check shit out and you think about shit, you can actually get uh, a, a, a grasp of what's going on around you, my nigga. And once you get that, he gonna preserve that time. For you. Like, okay, I see he trying to open his mind to it. So a lot of you motherfuckers better wake up, bro. This shit been happening for years. For years it's been going on. Under the nose of motherfuckers and people don't see it. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers just... You gotta get it together, man. But, oh, uh, yeah, man. That's crazy, though.